So first super important step before you go grocery shopping, check what you already have. Unless you're just a silly, reckless, crazy goose, you know, who doesn't keep tabs on what they already have, you'll probably spend a lot more. But if you check to see what you already have, you'll probably spend less money and not get too many things. Like less things will go bad. So let's check what we have. Kimchi, check. Leftover chicken curry stuff and stuffed bell peppers from my parents' house, check. Frozen fruit, some frozen vegetables, chicken, check. Oats, rice. This is actually kind of getting low, but um, should be okay for the week. Popcorn, some snacks. I found more rice, so <laughs> good on rice. There's only four eggs, so that is not enough eggs. We'll need to acquire more. So this is what I have for my grocery list. And sometimes I get some extra goodies if I'm feeling spontaneous and funky, but we'll see what happens. Gotta bring my own bags, of course. Rather slim pickings. Nice. The off brand one is usually cheaper. Oh, Nani? today it's not though. What the heck? Main brand. Always check your eggs by spinning them in the carton to make sure they're not cracked. My favorite kind of water is reverse osmosis, Bruh. but we don't have a reverse osmosis filter where I live right now, so I don't like tap water, so I think the plastic is just as bad, but what are you gonna do? There's so many different types of vegetables, but I feel like none of them are good, you know? It's crazy. Like how can you have all these vegetables and they're all kind of not that great? Family of one. I know this isn't good for you. I don't want to hear it. I'm getting it. <laughs> never going to sacrifice the creamer for the coffee. I always just get the cheap brand and I always get a different flavor every week just to keep it spicy. Oh my gosh. I feel like a little snack is in order, so maybe get a little snack. <laughs> okay, now that I'm here, nothing looks or sounds good. Bruh. I feel like goldfish are a good option just because the serving size is like 50 per serving. That's pretty good. But it doesn't sound very scrumptious. Oh, beets. That kind of sounds good. Okay, I just saw these. I usually don't like getting things that are marketed like protein like this but it actually looks very tasty and it's only three bucks so I'm gonna get it Greek yogurt just so you know you lactose intolerating people they also have lactose free this brand I also decided I want some cereal or granola for my yogurt I usually just eat it with um, fruit or I put it on like my oats but I think I would like something else this week god i haven't bought cereal in like a while last time i just bought that crispy rice off brand 
but I don't want that and I'm a little overwhelmed. Huh. So this is actually a huge reason I don't get that many things and I don't get that many cool things of variety. It's just because I hate choosing and I hate making decisions and I'm so overwhelmed. I almost don't want anything. I texted some of my friends and I was like, what kind of cereal should I get? Like, it's freaking me out. It's kind of sad. <laughs> okay, I made a decision. It was extremely difficult, but I got this one because I like these things. So I feel okay about this decision. This looks like a delicious treat that I need to acquire. Nice. Okay, so then traditionally what I do is I chug one of those kombuchas in the car. I don't know if you're supposed to chug something like that, but I usually do. It's kind of a ritual that I get the kombucha and I drink one immediately after I buy it. I don't think I'm gonna chug it, but I am gonna have a sip. Tonight, I chose happiness. Bruh. Wow. Let's see what happiness tastes like, huh? It's supposed to be elderflower, rose, chamomile and white tea chamomile chamomile i don't know don't come for me please tastes okay tastes like every other kombucha oh yeah it's just like the kind of thing you have to chug it's gonna jeez holy shit there's a raccoon damn Okay, you can't see him now, but there was a raccoon. I thought it was a cat, but it was bouncing around. Should we chase it? No, I think that would be mean. Okay. What if it needs our help though? Fighting crime or maybe getting into crime? I'm down for either, honestly. Okay, yeah, I'll probably finish this kombucha tonight, but I'm going to drive home now. How to take it all in one trip. Obviously, that's why I work out. Yes, sir. I literally lost the freaking thing that tells you how much it cost. I lost the receipt. It was like 54 36 which is pretty average for me. I usually, I only buy food for myself. It usually lasts me like a week and a half, a week. And it usually costs between 50 and $70 is pretty normal for me. Unless I just like am getting extra things that you have to get just once, like spices, then sometimes it can be like $100. But yeah, let me see if I can find the receipt. I found it, it was in my car. I was so close, but it was actually 50, 6.65. So again, pretty normal for me. I guess I'll put my goodies away. Bum, bum, bum. There's everything I think. I actually already put everything away and then I was like, hey, a shot with everything would be cool. So I brought everything back out. So I think that <laughs> this is everything except for the kombucha I already drank and two of the waters, which I didn't feel like bringing in. Oh my god, and the bananas. I forgot to put them over there. I also decided to try some of these Crunch Master Protein Brownie Thins. I don't know what I was thinking. I thought it would be like brownie brittle, which is pretty decent. It's ass. It's not good. I mean, for what you're getting, I guess it's actually okay. For 32 thins, which is like uh, quite a decent portion size, the thins look like this. Um, they're pretty salty. 130 calories, 2.5 total fat, 8 grams of protein, and 18 grams of total carbs. So I mean, I guess for what you're getting, it's not bad, but it definitely is not what I was thinking. We live and we learn and we grow and we prosper. Amen.
Bruh. Am I going to finish the bag? Right now? Maybe. Probably not. Hopefully not. Will I finish it eventually? Yeah. Do I want to? Not really. Will I? Yes. Such is life, you know? It just it is what it is. Also totally just random, but I tried one of these. I already ate it. Sorry. But I got the strawberry one. Tastes just like a Starburst. And also kind of like a fruit by the foot. So I guess it makes sense. Pretty good though. Pretty good. Anyway, thank you for coming to the grocery store with me. And I hope you have a beautiful day or night. Adios.